I am Christopher Healy, and I am going to read to you the first page of the first volume of my current series, A Perilous Journey of Danger and Mayhem. Chapter 1. The Age of Invention, New York City, 1883. It wasn't easy being the child of a genius inventor. There was the rooting through trash bins to find scrap metal, the misplaced wrenches winding up under your pillow, the constant cleaning of spilled pickle juice. But the job certainly had its perks, too such as front row seats to the moment your mother changed the world. For newly 12-year-old Molly Pepper, that last bit was going to happen in exactly eight days, and everything she had sacrificed would finally pay off. One week from tomorrow, the World's Fair would open its gates and Cassandra Pepper would present her Icarus Chariot, the very first personal flying machine, to the public. A hundred thousand people would crane their necks to see Molly and Cassandra soar among the clouds overhead. The crowd would be so awestruck, they would need medical assistance just to get their jaws shut again. And Cassandra could no doubt invent a device that would do just that. Molly wished she could have been there for the Icarus Chariot's maiden flight. But for the sake of secrecy, her mother had insisted upon a late-night test, and Molly only learned of her mother's historic achievement. When Cassandra woke her up, yelling, Molls! Molls! Guess what? Mr. Tortellini has a chicken living in his apartment upstairs. Oh, and the Icarus chariot works. That's how I saw Mr. Tortellini's chicken. <laughs>